You can't make that stuff up. 194 days after a teenager called 911 to report an intruder had shot his mother and her boyfriend in Liberty Hill, Williamson County Sheriff Mike Gleason told reporters the case was solved. In March, the mother was shot 11 times, the boyfriend twice. And it was clear that this was not a random attack. That's what neighbors thought at the time, too. Our main concern was for the safety of the people involved. The woman told police the only person who could have done it was her ex-husband, 38-year-old Clinton Harmon, and that they were in a dispute over child custody, but then nothing. So, I, yeah, I was surprised when I heard that they had arrested somebody. Until July, detectives got a call from Harmon's ex-girlfriend in Louisiana who said the shooting was planned. She recalled a family meeting in Bastrop County in July of 2023 where Harmon, his mother Teresa, and his fa adopted father Matt discussed ways to murder the victim as well as the judge presiding over the custody case. That's when law enforcement began 24-7 protection for the judge and his family as well as the victims. At the time of the shooting, however, Liberty Hill Police said the shooting appeared to be an isolated incident. And when the shooting originally happened in Liberty Hill, we, we looked it up and what kind of information we received as the press. Not very much information. It did say it appeared to be an isolated incident. Do you think releasing more information to the public back in March, was it, would have resulted in an earlier arrest? The hard to say because the uh, the tracker on the car was kind of the game changer. Then detectives discovered that the subprime lender who had a lien on Clinton Harmon's SUV had put a tracker on it when Harmon bought it. A subpoena for the vehicle location on the day of the attempted murder confirmed that the vehicle was just 0.4 miles from the crime scene. Clinton Harmon was arrested at the New Orleans airport on September 8th for attempted capital murder. On September 16th, U.S. Marshals arrested Matt and Teresa Harmon. The sheriff says they always knew the attack was personal. When you shoot somebody that many times, it tells you that's up close and personal. That is, that's vindictiveness.